Hey everyone, today I'm gonna show you how you can use uh, the merge feature from Midjourney, something similar to that in Stable Diffusion. So for that, you will require uh, to install uh, Control Net, which you can find from extensions uh, in available. You can you can check it out here. You'll find Control Net, and you need uh, a couple of different models. I'll be sharing the link from uh for this so it is t2i adapter in which you have to download the uh, you could start with style and color models which are like pretty uh the the sizes are pretty low compared to other con uh, control net models uh, they're around 154 mb 74 mb right so you just have to download those and put them in the extensions uh, model so let me just show you where you have to put them once you have downloaded the uh, models, you just have to put them in uh, extensions, HD Web UI Control Net, and here how to put them in models. Uh, you don't have to worry about the YAML files; they'll be downloaded automatically. So once you have downloaded uh, all of these, uh, then you need to go to your text image and uh, you have to select Control Net. And if you don't have multiple Control Net option, we just have to go to your uh, settings, control net, settings, control net, and here you could just have to suggest how many models, max number of models you can uh, go with. I have put a uh, three, you can go for four, two, so uh, two will be uh, pretty for, uh, will be pretty good for star, right? Then simply you just have to go to control net. You can choose any image you want. So let me choose the uh, Choose one image. Okay, let's go with this Ryan Reynolds image. So this will be the main image, right? In which you are going to apply the style for. So you just have to enable. You can go for canny or depth. But so let's uh, let me go with the depth model, right? Uh, we want an eight ninety six into five twelve image, right? Uh, and it, for style, you just have to enable it. You have to select uh, clip vision if you are gonna select the style transfer model, right? Uh, so I have, I have already uh, downloaded it. So T2I adapter style model, right? And you can just choose any style you want. We can go with this one. So this is from uh, Spider Man into the Spider Verse, or uh, you can just uh, look into any. Image. So this is one of the images I've created with. Uh, stable diffusion itself so maybe if you want to apply this style you just have to drag and drop this and after that you don't have to necessarily mention any prompt as well you can directly work right so with the original image and uh, here is the stylized image it's not necessarily that uh, great then you can actually mess around with the settings you can go with the guided start right so you can if you put it around 0 0.2 it's like after 20 percent of the process it will consider the image so it, you will get a more stylized image right uh if you want to reduce the stylized part you just have to put the guide at start at 30 percent and you know you just have to mess around with the settings and figure out what works best for you you don't have to necessarily mention the uh, prompts as well, but if you want, you can go with just uh, anime style. You don't have to put too, in, too many prompts. Just say it can say detail. In the native prompts, you can go with low quality from a worst quality and point eight unclear. You don't want it to be unclear, blurry or make right you don't have to mess around with the, the cfg scale works best with 7 or at max 9 or 12 so you can start with that then check out you can see what works best so yeah that's how you can create uh something similar to a merge feature in mid journey in stable diffusion uh, I'll be forwarding all the links for uh, downloading the 
control net models as well as the style adapter models as well. Uh, if you have any queries, do let me know. I hope you guys have a great day. That's about it. Thank you.